I don't care for it. I'd rather have a signal. I'd rather wait because people cut you off. They don't follow the directions. They don't do what they're supposed to. Traffic roundabouts are becoming more common in western New York, but they are still not popular with many drivers. I actually got an accident in one of them circles. So um, I think it's going to be a problem. Hamburg currently has five roundabouts. When we first began, people were blowing their horns and everything else and really creating a lot of havoc. But officials say overall, roundabouts do reduce accidents and increase traffic flow. Very few accidents now. If it is an accident, it's just a fender bender and you move on. After months of study and review of public comment, the State Department of Transportation will now spend $2.4 million to turn an accident prone intersection at Route 62 and Souls Road in Hamburg into a single lane roundabout. The more the better. If everybody buys by the same rules, you can go right through it, no problem at all. This intersection deals with very high traffic volume during Bills games and events at the Erie County Fairgrounds. And nearby residents like the Franciscan Sisters of St. Joseph worry a roundabout by their mother house will now make congestion even worse. I just question it. I'm not sure it's the best answer to that. Do you think you're going to be able to get out of your driveway? Probably not. The Fairgrounds is aware of the traffic problem and hopes the DOT plan will help. If if the traffic circle works at Souls Road like it has in the village of Hamburg, it'll be a wonderful asset to the area. But construction could make things challenging. There's a lot of traffic and uh, we try to be good neighbors and uh, try to advertise it and promote it to get people in and off the property and off the highways the best we can. The new roundabout will also include ADA compliant crosswalks with pedestrian signals and new drainage for the area. Now construction is supposed to begin next May with a completion date of December 2016. And right now the DOT says they do not plan on detouring traffic, but lanes will be reduced and shifted during construction. At Riley 7 Eyewitness News. Thank